Okay, so today we're going to learn how to take someone else's head and put it on someone else's body, just like you're seeing here. Okay, so let's get started. Now, the first thing you want to do is get an image that you want to attach your head to and try to get one that's facing, like, get a headshot that's trying to, f like, face in the right direction just like these two okay okay now what we need to do is using the pen tool you just trace around zoom in and just trace around the head just like that and then once you trace around the whole image you can make a selection out of that now just I'm just gonna pause it just while I do that now as you can see I've mapped around the whole head and I'm just going to click the last square which was the first one and then it will make a selection just like that. Now to turn it into a selection you have to right click and select make selection and then you can feather radius by one if you like and then that makes a selection there and then you can go into edit and cut just like that. Now click on the image that you want to put the head on and then go into edit and paste just like so and then we'll of course that's a bit too big so we want to go into edit transform scale and then just whilst holding shift just drag the top corner down till you get a rough match now you can zoom in and try to get an accurate match as possible but I'm just gonna roughly put it there just like that and then gonna zoom out just have a look alright looks a bit big so I'm just gonna go like so and then you just give once you're happy with where it is you can just give that a tick now I'm just gonna stretch that a little and on this side and then give that a tick now what we want to do next is create a layer mask on this layer just by clicking this button here and then selecting your brush tool uh, change the opacity to about 20 percent and then just sort of paint over this section here so it's just a bit see-through and then we want to increase the opacity to say about 50 percent and then just go over these edges here and then increase it to 100% just to get a nice blend and just click that like so now you can see it doesn't line up here exactly so I'm just gonna go into edit transform and then just pull that across just like so and then give that a tick now what we want to do is we want to match the color of the head to the body so to do this we want to go into image adjustments well first we want to select the image here not the layer mask and then go into image adjustments color balance and you just really got to play around with these until you get sort of the right color that you're after okay so probably going to go maybe about minus 77 here uh, probably minus 28 and maybe about plus 79 then you can change the highlights as well so you just sort of play around with it and just until you feel you've got a close match in the colors so you can sort of pl play around with this for ages I'm just going to quickly just match it up as best I think so yeah that's close enough I reckon so I'm just going to hit OK on that and zoom out now you can leave it at that and if you're happy with that or if you want to add like a shiny glossy finish you can go filter artistic plastic wrap 
and just use the settings maybe 10, 10 and 1 then hit OK as you can see it's made it a bit more shinier and then just to blend it a bit more you go filter, noise, add noise uh, use Gaussian and probably maybe about 4% because this is a magazine scan and it's a bit blurry so I'm probably going to say about 4% 4, 4 hit OK and then it makes it look just a bit broken up a little there so that's basically it I um, hope this has been a help to you and thanks for watching